Hey guys, what is up? Welcome to How to Build a Blog by uh, Zero Fats, uh, aka Cam Jennings. That is me coming at you on behalf of AdventuresOnTheRiver.com. Been wanting to put on this workshop for a little while, guys. I've just been really busy, uh, but now I've gotten a chance to get to it, and I'm really excited about it. I want to basically show you guys how to put together a blog and some of the plugins I use, and uh, uh, just just how to put it together real quick. Uh, it's really easy to do. It's not hard, and I think it's really important. Uh, you know, there's people out there that make full-time livings without blogs and without websites. Uh, however, I think if you want a really sustainable income online uh, and you want to have a nice foundation, I think it's really important to have a place that people kind of associate with you or your brand. Okay, so that being said, let's get into this, how to build a blog. All right. First thing uh, that you're going to find as kind of an obstacle when you start wanting to put a website together or a blog is uh, you're going to try to start figuring out what you want to call it. And it's going to be kind of a obstacle. It's going to be a pain in the butt. And a place I like to use that's very helpful to me is a site called NameMesh.com. This is a pretty cool site. And uh, you can put little random words in here and it will give you lots of different variations of websites that are available using those words if that makes sense um, for instance uh, if I want to make a, a, a blog about uh, you know making money online if I want to be in the make money online space I can be like uh, you know make money online right I can type those two or three words in and see what kind of variations they can give me okay and It'll start pulling back things that are actually available uh, that have to do with what I typed in. Use money online, uh, make donation online, play money online, run money online, see money online.com, make money online dot center, you know, all these different ones. New make money online, all these different. And sometimes what's really cool is you'll see these. And it'll kind of spark your mind and spark some creativity to think of something else. Um, you know, like uh, like new money online. I think that's kind of cool. New hyphen money hyphen online. I don't really like that hyphen deal. I don't like it. It's too, too much trouble for people. Uh, old money online. Old money online dot com. That's available. That's crazy. Old money online is available. Wow, that's pretty neat. Uh, new tax online. Anyways, you guys get the idea. Um, and this can work for anything. You know, if I wanted to, you know, do a, like affiliate marketing. You know, I could type in affiliate marketing and see what comes up. You know. And you can play around with something like this. You know, and I get the name is, it seems like it's important. But a lot of times, you know, with the names, you're just kind of projecting, um, you know, you, when you take a long time with the name, you know, you're, you're kind of just projecting your uh, kind of like, you know, insecurity or, or, or lack of confidence in what you're getting ready to do because you've never done it before. And the name is just kind of like the first part of that. So yeah, everything kind of gets projected onto the name. But here's the fact, all right? You're going to make the name. The name's not going to make you, okay? If uh, Jeff Bezos, the guy who created Amazon.com, can name his website, which is now the biggest online retailer in the world, if he can name that after a river in South America, um, that has nothing to do with online retail. Um, if he can do that and make that name Amazon synonymous with the biggest online retailer in the world, then trust me, you make the name, the name doesn't make you. All right, so just remember whatever you pick, there's no real wrong answer. Okay, just go with it. Find something that you think makes sense, find something you think is kind of cool, don't spend forever on it. Take a day, find something, and roll. Okay. Don't make it a big, huge thing. You don't want to take weeks and weeks on this stupid name thing. All right. Now, me, I got something I'm going to use. Um, I figured it out last night. 30 days to money. 30daystomoney.com is what I'm going to go with. And uh, I will uh, see you guys in the next step. That's it. Let's uh, get our name and I'll head over to hosting because when you do uh, – a blog, uh, there's two things you're going to need absolutely for sure. You're going to need 
uh, a domain. You're going to have to register a domain, and then you're going to have to get some hosting. Both of these things are super simple, and I do them both in the exact same place. So uh, let's head over to my hosting company, and uh, I will show you guys what I do. All right.